Hi, it's Ray Edwards and welcome back to the vlog. And this episode will sound as though it's about dieting and exercise and nutrition. But it's really about so many other things. It's about commitment to an ideal, about a promise you've made yourself and then perhaps you broke it. Did you break a promise to yourself yesterday? Did you promise that you were going to eat well on Thanksgiving and you actually ate a bunch of pumpkin pie or ice cream or way too many mashed potatoes and gravy? Don't feel bad. I mean, a lot of people had that same thing happen to them. A friend of mine, Dr. Susan Pierce Thompson, who runs a website called brightlineeating.com. You should check it out. She teaches that your brain is what blocks you from losing weight in most cases. Your brain is playing tricks on you. And so she helps people draw bright lines or firm boundaries about what they will and will not eat based on how susceptible they are to being really drawn to food. But I don't want to go into that. What I want to focus on is how she advises you deal with it when you cross the bright line, when you cross the boundary, when you say to yourself, I'm only going to eat the turkey and the vegetables and the salad and I'm not going to eat the mashed potatoes and the pie and the ice cream. And you did exactly pretty much the opposite or you ate all of it and way too much. What do you do? You've fallen off the wagon. You could either get into a shame spiral or you could do what Susan recommends and you could simply resume. So today, if you fell off the wagon yesterday, even if you fell off the wagon again this morning, if you had pumpkin pie for breakfast, today, don't worry about that. Don't do the shame spiral thing. Just do this. Simply resume. It is that simple. You can just pick back up where you left off. I hope that helps. Leave your thoughts and comments below. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to the YouTube channel. I would appreciate that. You would have my gratitude. It's a week of gratitude. Until tomorrow, God bless.